another look at our campsite up here in the National Forest. This is the Apache Sitgreaves National Forest outside of Greer, up at about 8,500 feet. So I've had a few questions about our cooking setup. Uh, there's a couple seat pads, that's not exactly cooking, but part of it. This is our cook kit, three nesting pots, and this is all that we need. We don't cook anything elaborate, you know, it's one pot meals, but they all nest together. One thing that I have learned by trial and error is that you should put a little piece of shelf liner in between the pots. We have three pots, a couple bowls, a couple cups. Those are just measuring cups. We don't really use those for drinking because we also have a couple uh, insulated coffee mugs, and that's what we use for drinking, plus some water bottles. These are popcorn bowls or some type of cheap bowl from the dollar store. And this is what we use for washing dishes. But the main reason I use these is because they're flexible and they squeeze into the last little bit of space. And the dollar store bag there, that's where we keep our oatmeal and walnuts, craisins, brown sugar, the fixings that we put on top of the oatmeal. A little container of coffee for the percolator. A uh, microfiber towel, that's our dish towel. A little scrubby, that dries instantly. And that's our kitchen setup. So let me show you how it all packs up. So here's the bottom drawer. We've got our cook kit, the uh, percolator, We've got a fire extinguisher, some miscellaneous trash bags, Ziploc bags, um, dish soap. Down the corner I've got some hot dog sticks, uh, roasting marshmallow sticks that are cut to fit the length. But here's the little uh, round plastic tubs that we use for um, washing dishes. They're actually, they actually will fit in here just fine, but if space gets a little tight, you can just push them down in there, and that's where I keep the the, uh, um, the propane canister. But I hate rattles, so before I put anything in there, I take a microfiber towel and I put that over the cook kit. And then I squish everything in. Got a couple miscellaneous trash bags, Walmart bags. And that's the way it rolls. I did 16,000 miles a summer without a rattle. The upper got some glasses, some plates, some paper plates, a frying pan, regular kitchen utensil container here. The most important thing is the is the handle for the cook kit and then uh, spatulas and some aluminum foil, a couple more microfiber towels, uh, salt and pepper, paper towels, Lots of extra microfibers, anything that'll keep. So there's there's room on top of here to stack, you know, boxes of granola bars or whatever else you might need. And that's the back of the camper. There's the water jug, the cooler. Here's the the black bag with the breakfast breakfast fixings and stuff that in the cooler and we're ready to roll.